What's up? What is up, Periscope? What is up, Facebook? What's up, YouTube? I need everybody, that if you are in Periscope right now, to come over to Commission Reviews and hit that like button for me on YouTube. Periscope, I need you guys to subscribe. If you are in Periscope and it's your first time here, welcome. And, and go ahead and hit that follow button on Periscope for me on Facebook as well. Welcome, everybody, to Commission Reviews, okay? <laughs> so. As a blogger, you know, you go through, you listen to your live video uploads, and you just, you know, do a replay, playback, whatever you want to say. You also go, like I go to my Periscope, because I also stream, like I said, I stream on all. I stream on Facebook and YouTube and Periscope at the same time, okay? First of all, happy Saturday to everybody, okay? Um, Please don't forget to hit that like button. And... All right, so this is what we're talking about today. We're talking about Derek. So I did a video, a live, excuse me, where I was speaking about the day after Bailey got evicted from the Big Brother house. I said that Bailey confirmed that David, I mean David, excuse me, that Derek um, pre-gamed and everything else. And I remember when I did that live, I was like, I I almost said, Derek, if you're watching this, you know, I almost said that, but. I was like, Derek's not going to watch this. Because I just, I'm on blog and I give my opinion about it. So anyway, before I begin to all that. So as I was looking, and I saw my notifications. And I was like, wait a minute. I was like, I said, okay, I got 700 people that watched the uh, live. Pretty cool. And it showed me the new replay viewers. And it was Derek. I go live. I was just like, wait, what? Okay. Okay. Mm. I was like, interesting. Okay, he saw my my video. Which I think is cool, honestly, because you normally wouldn't think that, you know, anybody that you see or watch or whatever um, would either check out. I mean, I guess if you said something about them, of course, they're going to check it out. If I saw my name on the video or, or anything, not, I don't think I'll check out everything, but I probably would look at some things. But this is what I said. Oh, okay, so he saw my video, and I was talking about him. Now, obviously, he probably didn't like some of the things I said in the video, but I would just give my opinion, and I always say it throughout the video, is this is allegedly about the situation about him being, as far as pre-gaming the Big Brother 22, as far as me saying, I feel like that, Derek, this is his season, even though he did not actually enter Big Brother 22. I still feel like that. I feel like he we had heard, we've heard his name so many times in this season that it's crazy. And he hasn't even stepped foot in the house as far as this season. Because of the conversation. So I just added to what I already said. Especially because it was the same day that Bailey uh, got home or whatever to see that he actually watched it because I actually posted it was on my Twitter connected Periscope with Twitter are connected. So if you're in Twi- if you're in Periscope, please tweet this out and repost this please. 
So I don't know if, if you know how how he really felt about me saying that because he posted and said before that he was not involved with this. This is a you know fake news. He didn't say that, but just pretty much saying that. And what I also said about Derek, I said that if he actually would have entered the house and would have actually pulled this off, that anybody known about it, that I could do nothing but respect the man for this. If if this would have actually happened. But instead, I feel like it, it, it kind of was like a mess <clears throat> because it was kind of like a mess because the fact of the matter is everybody that's in the house is speaking about it, saying that they knew about it or people who figured it out. I don't know, it just doesn't look good. And then when I see the connection with CBS involved, which made, this is all allegedly, like people were saying in the chat, to stir up some kind of buzz for the TV show for the Big Brothers is coming up. So, Derek, if you actually see this live or if you're even watching it, as a blogger, I'm going to, you know, do my commentary and give my opinion. But at the same time, I am a Big Brother fan. And as far as the game is concerned, I was, you know, I still am. I, the thing about it is because I'm doing commentary about this. Doesn't mean I'm still not a big fan of Derek and when he was on there in the past. People have different feelings, as I saw in the chat about, is, is pre-gaming right? Is it fair to other people in the house who didn't have the opportunity? And that that really is the question. Is there a more compass? Is that okay that those guys get like that extra footing when it comes to Big Brother and everybody else has to work from the ground up. I don't know. Because it all is a competition at the end of the day. And sometimes a competition, you do what you got to do to get to the end. I don't know. I don't know if there's, any, if, there's, if there's any rules about this. But when I watched the video by Jeff, who's from Big Brother, who now hosts his show, talking about celebrities and stuff like that. You know, he was saying people would try to do things to get their attention as far as the Big Brother house gets by throwing things over the fence just trying to get a message to him and of course big brother cbs did not want that to happen because it th and it throws your game off because you are in this cocoon this bubble with these same people and you know you're going back and forth and the only information that you are given is what is in within the house something from the outside can mess it up so for a secret situation like this i felt like you know I went back and forth, like, is this right or not? So, my thing is with Derek, I would seriously, I would I would have him on my channel. I would literally have a conversation, because I would love to ask him a few questions. Like, for instance, and I, I really don't want to say the question, but just because it actually happens. I always, you know, but as far as the Big Brother house, all jokes to the side, The fact that you're they're bringing you involved with this and you haven't even entered the house, does that make you want to be on the show? Does that make you want to join the show, especially seeing the thing that had the things that have happened inside the house this whole entire season? So it would just be a few questions that I would ask Derek if I actually had him on my show, but I don't know if he didn't like the things that I said because what I said that the confirmation saying that he actually were trying to make an alliance, pre-game alliance before, if you would have gotten to the house. And then there's other things swirling around, like I said in my video, of course, obviously about other people saying that Nicole's a snitch and she's the one that got him where he could not come in the house. So my feelings about this, honestly, when I first saw it, I was like, the first thing I said, honestly, well, he watched it and probably thought something negative, like, she don't know what she's talking about, or whatever. You know, he may have thought that, but I still would like to have a discussion. If he actually would, would like to, I would do it. I would have a discussion with him talking about this whole situation and maybe what he thought about what I said and everything else. I would. I 
I will I will admit that it felt good to you know like a, now, let me see when you're doing things like covering these different things and you see somebody that's involved with that that watches it yes it does feel good it's not like a negative thing like, oh my god he saw it no I thought of it as a positive thing which is what I'm talking about it now but it's a mixed emotion because I don't know how he feels about it but it is what it is when you're a blogger you're gonna probably do and say things about people uh, celebrities or whatever and people are not gonna like it and it just kind of comes with territory at the end of the day so. And I also want you guys to know what was going on. I don't tell you anything going on behind the scene, but I wanted you to know because we do cover this topic. Um, yeah, he checked out the video that we, we all were talking about it the other morning. He probably saw the chats. I posted the chats that y'all were saying different things. So, hey, Derek, it's, 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 what's up? It's all good, bro. <laughs> I'm glad you checked out my content. <laughs> you know what you could do for me, Derek? Won't you share this on your Twitter? And tell her about check out Kamisha Review. And I did. That'd be something, bro. <laughs> hold up, hold up, hold up. Wait. Oh, my goodness. I got too many things going on. So anyway, that's all I have for you guys. I just want to tell you guys that he out, he checked out my um you know my little video, and um he didn't say anything. Obviously, he didn't. It's, it's Periscope, but he didn't say anything. He didn't put that in the comments on YouTube or on Twitter or anything like that. Um, uh, I was like, I think I tweeted him. I said, man, you know you was the one that was involved or something. I don't know what I said, but you know he probably don't take nothing I'm saying seriously. He probably get all kind of stuff, but. Yes, Derek, if you do check out this video, shout out to Derek. <laughs> well, why don't you go ahead and tweet me out real quick. Tell everybody to check me out on Kamisha Reviews. And that would be on all of the social media. I sure appreciate all the love that I get from everybody else. Ori, that's what I was saying, bro. I was like, wait. <laughs> Do not forget to subscribe to all my social media so you don't miss out on anything else that I post. <laughs> Ori, I was like, that is crazy. I was like, you know, that's, well, because the video had posted. The video, the video had posted. When I went to work, and I just happened, oh, I just happened to check. I just happened to check. Uh, I always look to see who watched my video on Periscope because it shows you how many views you get or whatever. And I was looking, I said, oh, it got like 700 views. And I was like, wait a minute, Derek. And then, you know, that's the only Derek I was talking about. I said, that's not really him. Clicked on the profile. I said, that is him. Oh, my God. I was tripping. I was like, you that's crazy. I said, that is so crazy. So yeah, that's what's up. <laughs> Look, I said, or all he gotta do is take my uh next time get my, my video and tweet it out and tell everybody to check me out. Bro, that's what I'm saying. He's pre-gaming you. Oh, is he? Oh, my God. Look. If I get a tweet out of the pre-game. <laughs> I'm like, I'm down. You crazy, Ori. How you doing, Ori? I, I posted Ori video, his last video about the different um, speeches on my community wall. I need to go check out Ori. I did post it on my my uh, community wall. Ori said, Derek is pre-gaming me right now. Oh, my goodness. I 
I just wanted to come through and um, show you guys, like I said, what's up. And uh, make sure you guys tweet this out. Make sure you guys tweet it. Wait a minute. Thanks for the shout out, Derek. We know you pregame this season. What you see, what you get. Like I told you, I have I post all comments. So I said, wait a minute. You have to be in the line from the cold. Oh, Ori, no. I can't think that no any voice. No, I can't do it. Uh, what you see is what you get. Said thanks for the shout out, Derek. We know you pregame this season, and like I said, I post all peace reviews, people, all my people, the comments I post them. So even though it is a, it's a, it's showing on Periscope and Twitter, on YouTube, and I post the comments, so everybody can see it on the screen. So if you see people in the red, I see people in the blue. The red is YouTube, and the blue is Periscope. I said, welcome to each other's product, Miss Reviews families. I have them all over and on Facebook. Anyway, that's so what I want to tell you guys. Like I said, y'all, please make sure y'all tweet this live for me. Share this live from your Facebook. And if you have YouTube or your community wall, post this on your community wall. And we'll probably be back again at some point in time today about something. Okay? And let me go ahead and blow you guys a kiss because you guys know what blowing the kiss means. <laughs> 